it's not pure basic research in the sense that you have a researcher who has just some idea they're very interested in and they they just pursue that and it's more that it's an industry problem that's that's brought to BCIT and we have the expertise to help solve that problem. One of the really big projects now is the Smart Microgrid project. It will turn the BCIT campus into its own energy grid. We have a commercialization assistance program that's funded by Western Economic Diversification. And so it's working with entrepreneurs and small and medium-sized enterprises in BC. If we can't take those brains and actually apply them to something locally, uh, to a local company or allow companies to tap into that, it's really not getting the mass the same bang for the buck that it should. Um, so in our, in our case, we look at those kind of relationships, the industry academic relationships as being key. And clearly industry believes that as well when we look at the BC uh, IT 3D Cube project. The Cube improves learning by bringing 3D simulation-based learning environments and teaching systems into the classrooms. This allows users virtual hands-on training of the internal mechanisms of a component that would be, could be too difficult or expensive to access in the physical world. I get to meet all sorts of new people. We get to apply all sorts of different types of, of uh, equipment and technologies to test these products or processes to see if they're doing exactly what they're supposed to be doing. The motion capture system is a set of cameras and you would walk through the calibrated space where the cameras are. The cameras would show these markers in space, in three-dimensional space. BCIT helps small and medium-sized businesses to advance the state of practice. To find out more information about how to connect with BCIT, please visit us online.